fiber to fabric wool. Think of a cold winter's day when you are warm and cozy in your favorite sweater. What is that sweater made of? Wool. And where do you think wool comes from? While most people think of sheep when they think of wool, there are other animals that produce it too. But mostly, it is wool from sheep that we use for our winter clothes. Wool is the coat of hair that grows on the skin of these animals. It is also called fleece. Animals with thick fleece are comfortable even in cold winters. Early man saw this and realized that wool keeps them warm. Early people then started rearing these animals and using their fleece to make warm clothes for themselves. How do we get wool from sheep? Let's find out. The sheep is checked for lice first and then taken for removing wool. Removing wool is equal to shearing. Person who removes wool is equal to shearer. The shearer uses machines to shave off the fleece. It doesn't hurt the sheep. It's just like when you get your hair cut. It takes a shearer about 2 to 3 minutes to remove the fleece of one sheep. The fleece has a lot of mud, manure, grass etc. stuck to it. So, once the fleece is removed, it has to be washed. Then, the fleece is sorted. The fine soft hair is separated from the rough coarse strands. The washed and dried wool is then dyed in different colours. Then, the wool is spun into yarn. This is done on a spinning wheel. Some oils are used on the fleece to spin it into yarn. So, it has to be washed again. The long fibres are made into wool for sweaters and the short ones are used for woolen cloths. All the hair on a sheep is not the same. The outer hair is rough and the inner hair is fine. The coarse or rough outer hair is also called beard hair. The fine inner hair is also called under hair. The inner hair is softer and therefore more in demand for making woolen clothes. Some sheep have more of the coarse beard hair. Some sheep have more of the fine under hair. Some sheep are bred in such a way that they will have only the fine under hair. That means the parents are chosen that way to give birth to sheep who will give better wool. This is known as selective breeding. Sheep have to be looked after well. They are taken out in herds for grazing. They are fed pulses, corn, jowar, oil cakes and fodder. A healthy sheep gives good quality and quantity of wool. If a sheep is stressed, then the wool given by the sheep is not of good quality. Wool sorter's disease If the sheep have a disease and the germs are present in the wool, then the workers who sort the wool can get the disease too. That is why this is called wool sorter's disease. A special type of bacteria spread this way and cause a disease called anthrax. Even other farm workers who deal with the sheep and the veterinarians, animal doctors can get the disease. Normally, there is a vaccine given to these people to prevent the disease. Antibiotics can also be given to cure the disease. If it is left untreated, 
the disease can kill the person. These and other work related dangers are called occupational hazards. What did we just learn? The hair of sheep, goat and yak are used to make wool. The hairs of camel, llama and alpaca are also processed to yield wool. In India, mostly sheep are reared for getting wool. Sheep hair is sheared off from the body, scored sorted dried dyed spun and woven to yield wool